Hi everybody, Monica Dillon here and we're going to talk about one of the Link Assistant tools at LinkAssistant.com and it's called the Rank Tracker. Why would you want to use a Rank Tracker? Maybe you want to find out where your site is currently ranked for a particular keyword. We're going to take a very generic site. We've actually opened up Rank Tracker. I'm using the free version because I wanted you to see exactly what you can do with it, even the free version. Um, and then perhaps that'll give you incentive to go further with it. Uh, if you notice down here, the uh, search algorithm is often updated. So even in the free version, you get access to that. Okay, so we're going to take a very, uh, this is a community kind of, this is a newspaper website and <clears throat> we're going to leave most of the preferred search engine stuff we're not going to fool with that but you see we're going to use Bing it's going to use also Yahoo and Google and wow it found a lot of different keywords here I didn't put these in here so it's interesting that it actually found these uh, I want to actually see where this site ranks for um, we'll keep New Orleans news Louisiana news and the, the program typically likes to keep the number of keywords to a minimum, I think, of three or four. We're also going to search for the New Orleans Saints. Let's see where the site ranks for that. And then also um, <clears throat> uh, Mardi Gras 2013. So what happens is it begins to look for um, the rankings and it's it's pretty quick in this particular case the difference between what you see right now the rank tracker free version and the upgraded versions is you're not going to be able to save your work so if you're working on projects for yourself that you want to come back to you don't want to necessarily uh, have to redo everything then your best bet is to get the upgrade. See if we wanted to save it, it says upgrade your license. Okay, so you've got Louisiana News, Mardi Gras 2013, and you see it's giving us the rankings right here. Let's sort these, and NOLA.com ranks number one for New Orleans News, number two for Louisiana News, uh, New Orleans Saints, number five. And these stats that you're seeing right now are pretty, they're up to date. I've, I've checked this before in uh, Rank Tracker. It's one of the programs that I've used less, but we'll be using more of now that I'm really starting to really uh, like the features in this, in this particular, in this particular software. So historical records, uh, that's something that you can explore. You see the search engines, uh, where it actually ranks for what the, what the URL is, the ranking data. You could see exactly what the URLs are here, the pages that are ranking in Bing for Mardi Gras 2013. So it's kind of got a grid function in that when you highlight the keyword here down below, and we can bring this up so that you can, so that we see it closer together down below you can actually see what the URLs are that are ranking and the last check date which you'll see uh, is December 20th New Orleans Saints ranks number five in Google ranks number two in Bing number two in Yahoo and again if we just wanted to verify that you can always go to the search engines and I have actually verified this on different searches we won't do it in the for the purpose of this recording but these stats are up to date so this is one of the nice things about the rank tracker tool uh, it also uses your Google rank your Google Analytics account if you want to continue to collect data so you can tell it to do that or not do it even with the free account we're not going to do that here but it's really uh, got some some neat features so if you want to find out where you rank for a particular site, then Rank Tracker is a, a great way to do it. Uh, some companies now are, are not supporting rank tracking in the, 
uh, in the coming in the coming months so this is a nice way to kind of check this all right that's it for rank tracker I uh, hope this helps you make a decision about whether to use it one of the nice things about rank tracker and all of the link assistant tools that I will say that I've, I've found very useful is that you can use it whether you're on a PC or a Mac and um, it's it's not dependent upon it's not dependent upon your operating system and it's also not dependent on a website per se so you're not going to get charged for uh, the resources that you use when you do your search sure some of the searches are going to take a few minutes you can always go back go and do something while your reports are running but it's not going to use any additional resources on a website that you're going to get billed for there are some programs where you're actually uh, charged a higher subscription fee just because you're using their resources every month one of the nice things about rank tracker is that you don't have to have a membership once you purchase your license it's a lifetime license and after six months you do have the option of continuing to extend your algorithm updates which it's well worth it um, but all in all I think rank tracker is a, a really great program and especially I'm just using the free version can't save my work but again can always upgrade all right, talk to you guys soon. I hope this helps.